these people think they could take my kids without me knowing it and take my kids from me at newborn and and God put my Gerber babies in my womb and so there ain't no way that, that they could have took them unless somebody called and snitched and I'm going to find out because my kids are supposed to be with me. It's the law for children to be with the real mother and the real father who birthed them from their soul and womb. Now, they got all this other type shit going on, all this violence and tapping people's phones and and um making people like they they slave and shit. It, 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 that shit gonna stop. For real, for real. Because the violence gonna stop because I already prayed to stop abortion and it's the law now. Nobody can have abortions. So now it's time to get my kids back. So who who think they got my kids and think they their mother and father and they will never be raised right with y'all. They only could be raised right with the real mother and father. It's up to them if they want to graduate, come home to me and their real father, Joy Michael Lampkin. But if anything else besides that y'all not supposed to have a people kids you foster care cps people because that hurts jesus taking kids from the real mother and father that really hurts jesus because he blessed her with children from my woman's souls and ch because children are a blessing from god now, now you trying to make me know that I ain't going to know Jesus without my kids. I still know Jesus without my kids. But I bet you one thing, you can't take them out of my soul or womb. My Gerber sons. My five Gerber sons. One is resting in peace shining on in heaven, though. My first Gerber son, twin brother. I had a miscarriage with him because my husband hit me in my stomach. And, and he testified in court that he saw the nurse do that to my first son. So how can he, how can they say I did it because I'm the mother? You supposed to have a video camera in that nursery video recording all them babies in case one get kidnapped like y'all kidnapped my kids. And as well, like the police officer was in my son's nursery uh, with a gun on his waist. So how the hell you think you're going to get away with kidnapping people's kids and Jesus is going to destroy you? Jesus is going to take all, 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 everything you ever had. You're going to wish you'd never been born you, you by taking my Gerber sons because they're a mine. They came from my womb. I laid on that labor bed and had them from my womb and soul. Like that. So... Whether you know it or not, you will never be a mother and father if God don't bless you with a mother and father in your womb and soul. Because it's in the Bible. In the Bible, it even says that uh, no woman will, left be, uh, will uh, be left uh, without having children. So why don't they just pray and ask God to bless them with children? Instead of taking other people's kids that really needs to know their real mother and father. Because... You trying to put people back in slavery by taking people kids by the lack of God's knowledge. So whatever you own and, and all them all this drug and violence going around, you're not keeping my kids safe. The only thing that's going the only person that's going to keep them safe is the Holy Spirit. And that's who they are adopted by, the Holy Spirit. So whoever called and snitch, God bless your ass. And you better hope that your kids don't be taken too. Amen.